Hello, hello YouTube, Trashtex back with another video and today's video is about how to fix a slow internet issues on Windows or Windows 11. Actually, it will work for Windows 10, Windows 8 or any Windows product. You can use this solutions. On this video, we are going to see eight basic solutions to solve a slow internet connection. So stay tuned until the end of the video. So the first solution to solve this problem is removing temporary files. So to remove the temporary files here, we are going to click here the search and type run. Type run and open the run dialog box. And on the run, you can, you type temp, T-E-M-P. I think it's visible temp, then select OK. So you'll find here temporary files. So these temporary files may create an obstacle on your internet connection speed. So uh, control plus A on your keyboard, then shift plus delete on your keyboard. So it will, are you sure you want to permanently delete this, this temporary files Then select yes. So it will remove all those files, but some files may be not deleted. So skip for, those uh, undeletable files so skip them and close the, the, the window so the other uh, temporary file location is again we are, we are going to type here run we are going to open the run and here again we will type a prefetch prefetch type here prefetch and select OK. And again, you will find here another temporary file that creates uh, challenges on your internet speed. So uh, select Control A, then Shift plus Delete and press Yes to permanently delete all those temporary files. And this will help you to boost up your internet speed. The next solution that will help you to fix the speed of your internet is uh, selecting here the Windows icon and open setting, open setting and go to Windows Update here on Windows Updates. You will find Windows Update on Windows 10 or 8 or other products. Then after, after you get into the Windows Update here, you will find Advanced Options. On the Advanced Options then, go to here delivery optimization so after i open delivery optimization allow download from other pieces so this also takes or consumes a lot of internet uh, data in your computer so make sure you turn it off this uh, allow download from other pieces so turn off this and go to again advanced options here advanced options then download setting on uh, updating uh, your window so it's going to show you download settings on the download settings here select percentage of measured bandwidth so you should have to allocate the percentage of measured bandwidth so select here percentage bandwidth and limit how much bandwidth you are going uh, your computer will going to use. so make it to the least and again select this one and make it to the list and upload setting again select this one and make it to the list and monthly upload limit and select this one and make it to the list and close the uh, page or, or the, 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 the explorer so this also helps you to uh, solve the speed of your internet then the other solution will be which is going to here the search icon and type view network connection view network connection so here we find the view network connection under the control panel then we are going to open it here you may have ethernet or wi-fi or other options so use the 
internet option that you are using. So I'm using the internet. If you are using Wi-Fi, you can use your Wi-Fi. So I'm using the internet and I'm going to select internet and right click on it, then select here properties. So under the properties, you are going to search for internet protocol version four here, internet protocol version four. So after you select this, then go to here properties. So on the properties, uh, on most of the computers, it will be obtain DNS server address automatically. But you should have to select use the following DNS server address. So select use the following uh, DNS server address and type the Google uh, DNS server, which is 88 and type here 8844. Okay. Then select OK. So it will automatically get into Google. Then OK. Then select close and close the open window. So after you close this one, this will be the other solution that will help you to boost up. And, and the other solution will be opening your CMD and closing uh, some commands or auto-tuning uh, activity. So go to search here. Then type here CMD, then the command prompt will appear and then select run as administrator. So run, ad, run as administrator open automatically. Then here we have a command in order to disable the auto tuning label. So it will help you, uh, which is auto tuning is uh, the applications or softwares inside your computer may communicate using the uh, internet that you have inside so you should have to disable the auto tuning label so in order to disable you can use this comment and if you want to enable it back you can use enable auto tune label you can use this command to enable so uh, for now to speed up the internet uh, i'm going to use i'm going to disable the auto tuning so i'm going to select here and copy then i'm going to here and paste it and press enter. So as you can see, it's also uh, tuning label is disabled and said, okay, then close your uh, command prompt and the notepad also. So after you check the CMD and if the problem is still appearing, and the next solution will be updating the driver. So to update the driver, then we are going here on the search and type here, device manager so here we find the device manager then open the device manager and on the device manager here here we have network adapter i think it's visible here network adapter and click the arrow here and on the network adapter here we have different uh, networks you may have wireless uh, or ethernet adapter so to update all this you should have to know the adapter that you are using so to check which adapter is you are using here uh, click on the search and type view nate sorry nate work connection so here we have view network connection and let me show you here i'm using real tech ethernet control and you can check if you are using wi-fi you can you can check the device manager or the adapter the network adapter that you are using so i'm using the real tech ethernet controller so i'm going to minimize it here and select and here right click on it and select update driver so select the update driver and search automatically for drivers in order to update the driver so i'm going to select here search automatically for drivers so select so it will search and installing the driver and it will take some time based on the speed of your internet then windows has successfully updated your driver and then close this one and close your uh, device manager and check the speed of the internet and if it is not working uh, fast then the other solution will be again go to here on the device manager device manager 
open the device manager then uninstall and reinstall it back your uh, network adapter so select here the network adapter and select the adapter that you are using here and select uninstall sorry right click on it then uninstall the device so when i select uninstall the device it's showing me warning but keep uninstalling so it will remove it as you can see it's removed then you are going to click here to restart it to reinstall it back here scan for hardware change so select here the scan for hardware changes and it will scan and it will reinstall back the driver and close the device manager and check your internet speed if it's getting back to the normal or speed up position and the other solution that we are going to use is if all the solution not working resetting your network so to reset the network here if you have uh, ethernet or wi-fi just right click on it and select network and internet setting so after network and internet setting open here select advanced network setting so after you get the advanced network setting here it will show you network reset so select network reset then after network reset comes here it will reset it so uh, it says here this will remove uh, this will remove then reinstall all your network adapter set other networking components back to their original setting so accept it and reset now and are you sure you want to reset your network settings then select yes and it will reset it to its original location so your windows will shut down in five minutes it's saying so then uh, you'll be signed out and close this one and wait until your pc shut down and restart back and check uh, whether your computer uh, internet speed gets well or not if all the solutions is not working the final solution that i'm going to recommend is factory reset so to factory reset your computer here select here the windows icon and go to here setting and after you go to setting here under the system it will under the system it will show you here here on the bottom recovery so select recovery then reset this pc reset this pc so select reset this pc before that you should have to know all your data will be removed. so uh, keep all your files or necessary files uh, on uh, external drives or on your drives uh, and reset your computer so select reset pc and it will provide you want to keep your files but it will remove all the applications and settings but keep your personal file so select remove everything or keep my file based on your interest select if you want to keep your file keep my file and it will reset your computer so these are all the solutions to fix your windows uh, internet speed if it is slow use all the solutions i hope all these solutions may boost up your internet speed and if this video is helpful please give me thumb up subscribe my channel and you can give me comments on the comment section for today Chash take out